Hey what's up guys, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be going over why you should use Control Freaks. Now I have made Control Freak videos in the past, but it's been a while since I made one. I think I've gained around 300,000 subscribers since the last video I made on them. So although I do mention them in my videos regularly, I think it's about time I make a video talking about them a little more in depth. But just before the video starts, if you could drop a like and subscribe, that'd be much appreciated. And use code FLEE in the item shop if you would like to support me further. Anyway, let's get right into it. So starting out, the first question some of you might have is what are control freaks? And basically control freaks are thumbsticks that clip firmly onto your existing controller analog sticks to give you more range of motion, as well as a lot better grip. Control freak have an amazing video on the science behind these little guys. So yes, they're not just for looks. I highly recommend you watch that video right after this one. But basically clipping on a control freak thumbstick instantly gets you 47% more arc distance, which lessens your thumbstick tension. So what that means, if you want to be a lot smoother and more precise player, then control freaks are definitely for you. Less thumbstick tension gives you like a really nice light freedom feeling in your analog stick, whereas without control freaks, it's a much more tight and tense feeling. So if I just show you without control freaks, as you can see, the analog sticks really like it's tight and it's flicky as well as if I get my finger to go back and forth as you can see it's like sliding across but if I grab my controller with the control freak as you can see the exact same tension there's no there's no sliding because I get that grip as well as it's a lot lighter I can do a lot more smaller and precise movements so with my control freaks I can do those nice like smooth circular motions really really easily but without control freaks it's a lot more like pointy it feels a lot more jagged and less smooth anyone that has control freaks will understand how much lighter the stick feels and how much easier it is to control. Razor X is someone that I believe uses control freaks. It actually looks like he uses Infernos in his hand cams. And Infernos are these ones right here. So there you have the Inferno and that is the Inferno grip. So it's kind of like a swirl. And with control freaks, because the analog stick is now longer, it requires less force to move the analog stick. And going off control freaks video, that's 32% less force. Less force when moving the analog stick means less fatigue over time, which means you can flick faster and play longer. I've been a proud partner with control freak for the good part of seven months now. And with all my time being there, they haven't had any huge sales except this weekend right now. So if you're lucky enough to be watching this video within the first two days of posting, you can still grab yourself a pair of control freaks for 20% off. So code FLEA at checkout normally gets you 10% off, but I guess it's your lucky day. But before you go ahead and buy anything, let me just grab some of my control freaks and give you a quick review. I'll let you know which ones I like and also which ones are the most popular. So starting off with the Galaxies, everybody uses the Galaxies, like everybody. These are personally my favorite and over my time on YouTube talking about these, they've soon become everyone's favorite. I'll have a whole bunch of photos come up on screen now. Everybody loves the Galaxies and it's mainly because of the grip. As you can see there, I'm kind of showing you the grip on them. These have been used for about six months, so do keep that in mind, but Control Freaks last a very long time. They also come in a super clean white. So clean yet that I haven't even used it and I really don't want to because honestly they'd get dirty, but these are the white ones. Definitely a fan favorite. You've seen them in all my hand cams. If you're gonna purchase any, the Galaxies are the go-to. So the Galaxies come in one high-rise stick and one low-rise stick, as you can see here on my Xbox controller. We got the low-rise here and the high rise here. So these galaxies on my Xbox controller are brand new, never used, and these ones are about six months old. As you can see, the difference is almost unnoticeable. Do keep in mind, if you are buying for an Xbox controller or a PS4 controller, the control freaks will be different. So don't go buying PS4 sticks if you have an Xbox controller. Also, if you have a scarf, control freaks do go on scuffs, but only if you have the PS4 sticks on your scuff. So I'm pretty sure if you've got scuff sticks on your scuff, then control freaks won't fit on. So I've showed you the galaxies, I've showed you the infernos, I'll quickly show you what I used to use, which are the classics. So here are the classics. They're just high rise, standard grip, just concave. Me personally, I prefer concave, which is when the analog stick scoops in rather than scoops out. If you prefer something that scoops out, you might want to get the battle royales, which are convex. So as you can see there, they scoop 
outwards rather than go inwards. So instead of your thumb resting inside the stick, it kind of rests on top of the stick. So that all just comes down to personal preference. The Battle Royales also come in a dark version, which is the Battle Royale Nightfalls. There are some people who do like the convex sticks, like the Battle Royales. Also got some Icon X sticks, which are just the Control Freak logo on a low rise stick. And that's about all I got lying around. Not to mention there's another 50 other styles on their website. Just make sure if you're using a PS4 controller, you get them under the PS4 category. Also stay tuned for future videos because I'll probably be giving these away. Anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Just thought I'd make a quick video on Control Freaks just in case some of you haven't bought them yet. Don't forget to use code FLEA at checkout this weekend only for 20% off. Even if you miss out on the sale, code FLEA still gets you 10% off. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you have an amazing day and I'll see you in the next one.